Good morning. This is Kate Green with the Divine Reading. And today is Monday. <coughs> the first card I pulled is the Queen of Cups. This is trustworthy, intuitive, unconditional love. I pulled Koi card. This is for abundance. Move with the flow of abundance around you and through you. Transform divine help, allow change and find the rainbows. I pull the chariot card. It's determination, moving towards your goals, going on a journey. Sloth, digital detox, recalibrate, reset, and recharge. Play. Have fun. Take a break. Inspiring nature. Go for a walk. Nine of Wands. Stability. Learning from experience. Achieving security. I put the owl. This says detach your emotions from situations that you cannot control. Flourish, stand proud, show up fully, nature your growth. Two of Cups, partnership, you and your passion, friendship. Okay, this one right here is a little tricky. I know this is a ladybug, but it says ladybird. And it says luck, all your manifestations. Manifesting positive thoughts and visualization have been heard. And relax. You've got this. Everything is okay. Divine benevolence. Relax. Divine will. It says, trust the path. Let go of your fear. Accepting that there is divine plan for every human being. Divine will is the process of our human experience to this unique blueprint. Every culture and religion has a narrative of their creative or personal God and their relationship with the human soul or spirit. That an overall plan exists for the outcome of humanity and each individual is a concept of this belief. While divine will is the concept that there is a divine universal plan for all of us, it still acknowledges that people have free will and the potential to make choices that lead us down this path. In essence, surrendering to divine will allows you to remove self-blocking patterns and tendencies that lead away from your true divine purpose here on earth. Currently, you are being asked to stop. Stop trying to force a door open. Your resistance will continue to make distance between you and your desired outcome. The overall picture is much bigger than you can see right now. Trust in the unique path and that you are exactly where you need to be right here, right now. Surrendering to the universe and divine will is removing the internal fight of being in control of every possible situation, issue, a scenario that would, that may or may not eventuate. When you stop and surrender, you can live to live freely, having a sense of freedom and letting go of events or circumstances that you simply cannot control. Affirmation: I let go of control and surrender to divine synchronicity. Power over seven scorpion. You are being initiated to a magic of conjuring so as to have power to affect lower vibrational forces through your own will and spoken word. You are guided to use this powerful gift with compassion and discernment with mercy and non judgment. You can then manage any toxicity in your life swiftly with great effect. And that is your reading for today. I am love.
we are love. Thank you for watching.